shall we talk about a fragrance from the house of Zhirzhov? Yes, please. And I just want to apologise before we get going that I look like a bag of shit. I've got the lurgy. So if we can get past that, it's happy days. Is good youtube hello ladies and gentlemen welcome back to my channel my name is mike michael mikey cologne and if you're tuning in and watching this thank you very much i do appreciate it as always right today i'm going to talk to you about a fragrance from the house of zerzhov if you know this house they are one of the best in the game their presentation packaging is luxurious the whole brand is luxurious Yes, there's been a few fragrances in there that I have tried that I didn't get along with. But there's also some in the, their brand that I absolutely love. And obviously, I own a few from the brand. So today, I'm going to talk to you about 40 Knots, which is from the Join the Club collection. And 40 Knots, they're all inspired. The fragrances are inspired by different clubs. And this is inspired by a yacht club. So I'm going to show you the presentation read you the notes what i do have and i'm going to talk to you about the fragrance a little bit so like i say the packaging is second to none it really is it's such such a gorgeous brand and look at the way that look at that that's just the box that and then that opens like so and then you've got like this velvet sort of wrapping and then look at that look Look at that bottle. You're telling me that ain't stunning? And then the bottle sits in there like so. You've got a little X logo in the middle. Right, let's put that down. Right, this is a 100ml bottle and this is other perfume concentration. The caps on these are solid and it does click into place. You've got a little that Zerzhov written on the collar of the cap. The X on the atomizer. That... I wouldn't be waving my bottle around like a nutter, but I know it's going to hold. But I still, people, do not pick your bottles up by the caps because if you ain't clicked it on there right and you do pick it up from the cap and that smashes on the floor, you're going to be crying like a little bubba. You really are, because I would be. So I'll show you the atomizer and then we're going to read the notes. So atomizer, great lovely distribution right you've got woodsy notes cedar seawater salt and green notes right when this opens up it opens woodsy you get the salt them sea notes it's got a marine vibe to this fragrance there is a green there's a greenness to it so it opens fresh salty and woodsy and like i say with a marine vibe to it after about 15 20 minutes this fragrance completely does a u-turn and this ambery tone comes in so then it turns rich warm and has a bit of depth to it so it opens salty fresh then it turns warm sweet and rich can i find amber anywhere in any note breakdowns no but Unless my nose is broken, I can definitely detect some type of amber in here, 110%. And to me, that's what does this fragrance justice. I love that. I like the initial opening. Yes, I do. But when it dries down a little bit, that is when I love the fragrance even more. And I know I've heard talk about this fragrance that you can rock it in the summer me i've never worn this on a hot day i save this for spring when it's cold outside and the sun is shining or i wear it in the winter because this has some good staying power we'll get to that in a second so let me repeat myself like a parrot opens fresh salty woodsy a marine vibe then after 15 20 minutes 20 minutes it turns and turns a bit ambery a bit warm, a little bit sweet, but you still have 
the saltiness in there. You still have the green notes, but they're then in the background. And that amber, that warmth and that sweetness is up front. And then notes that it started with have now taken a back seat. Great fragrance. Really, really is. I can't knock it for anything. I would say strong projection for the first two hours. Then it dulls in a little bit, but it's still radiating. This radiates on my skin, I would say, for a good five hours. Not beast, but you can easily detect it. Once that five hour mark goes, it draws down and then I'm left with about a foot scent bubble, which lasts for another couple of hours. Then it turns to a skin scent. And then I can smell this on my skin 10 hours after I apply it. Like I have to wash it off, then it is gone. Like if I wear it at night, I wake up in the morning, I'm still going to smell this on my skin. Guaranteed. So it will last you through the day and it will last you definitely through the night. When and where would I wear this? I think this is a bit more... I think it's a bit more of a dressed up scent. You can wear it whenever you want. If you want to wear it with shorts and a t-shirt and you want to wear it on a blistering hot day, you're entitled to do that. But me, I save this. All right, let's say if I'm going out for lunch and I've got some errands to run, I will wear this fragrance because obviously I know that I've got the errands to run, then I'm going to have a little bit of lunch. Or if I'm out for an evening for dinner i will rock this i just think it dresses up a little bit better but you can still wear it as a casual fragrance that is completely up to you so dresses up well lasts a long time smells great i know it's been around for a good few years now but i've just pulled it back out and i've just started to rock it again and i thought to myself i haven't spoke about this fragrance yet and i just wanted to talk to you about it a little bit just to sort of give you my insight on the fragrance and just to see if you people get the same sort of thing do you get that ambery tone in there does it go sweeter and richer on you because it does on me well people i appreciate your time for watching if I've forgotten anything, I do apologise. <laughs> I'm trying my best. Remember, people, spending goods always a pleasure and never a chore. Let me know what your favourite Zerzhov is from their house. It doesn't matter what collection it's from. Let me know what your favourite Zerzhov fragrance is. Or if you've got a couple, put them down in the comments. Let me know, people. I will see you on the next one. And thank you for watching.